If you are a CapCut editor who want to edit like these After Effects editors, then stop sleeping and use these oh. white flash overlay. First select your clips and then go to library and add a white overlay. To make a fade out and fade in flash you need about 2 or less seconds of white overlay and for normal flash you need only about 1 second of white overlay. Align them according to your clips and then we can start adding keyframes. Let's start with flash in and flash out. Go to starting of the clip then go to blend. Add a keyframe then bring opacity to 0. Now go to center of the clips and bring opacity to 100. And at the end go to ending of the overlay and set opacity to 0 again. This is what your flash should look like. We can leave it as it is, but we can make it even smoother. Now right click white overlay and select show keyframe animation. Select the keyframe in center and hit this graph option and click ease out to, then select other keyframe and this time click ease in two. These should already look much better, but you can change a little bit of graph as I do. Just copy me. This is the final result. Now simple flash is even more easier. Just go to starting of the clip and add keyframe and then go to end and bring opacity to zero. And just follow this graph settings. And there you have it. Now to make them even better, you can add some sound effects. The ones I am using are called Passive Transition and Camera Flash Sound Effect. You can easily search them. It's very easy and make a big difference in your edits, so make sure you use them. Subscribe and like the video if this tutorial was helpful, and I will be back with more.